wearing the recharge pants, drinking an insane amount of water. It's kind of all of us uh, doing, doing something together, even if it's something we wouldn't do on our own. We all kind of find particular spots on the bus. Seniors were kind of in the back, juniors were a little in front, and then we have a little scattered group of freshmen and sophomores. It's about a two hour, two hour ride to the airport. Um, uh, so the airport can be used to serve many different functions. Um, some of these functions include uh, catching up on homework, uh, sleeping, um, or catching up with teammates. Uh, everyone aims to be productive on the bus, but when you're surrounded by 20 or 30 of your best friends, it gets a little tougher. But uh, really, if you don't use your time on the bus, sometimes spreading out a little bit in the airport, um, putting your headphones in and doing homework uh, uh, can help you get a lot done. Or that could also be a time for one girl to ask another girl questions on homework or really help each other out a little bit. Um, but, uh, and then that's, that's also a great time to catch up with teammates. Sometimes you're just tired, you're in an airport, there's a zillion people around, and you just want to sit next to your best friend and talk to him for a while. And then there's, there's a couple good times, too, when you're really exhausted, where you just need to pass out. Some people have a great capability to do so in any position, and then some just can't sleep anywhere. Ice bathing. <laughs> there's, there's nothing quite like eight minutes of under 50 degrees. Um... But uh, it's definitely big on our team. And you don't just ice bath once a day. You ice bath usually three or four times a day. Um, eight minutes every time. Um, and it's a pretty, pretty miserable experience um, while you're in there, unless you have some type of distraction. Um, which uh, most of these distractions include each other, teammates, uh, phones, um, music, whatever we can do to get through the ice baths we do. Ice bathing inside is a lot more fun and just uh, right when you get out of that cold ice there's usually a hot tub nearby in the hotel so most people um, quickly jump in the hot tub and get their senses back in their feet and their legs. Uh, one of my favorite parts of traveling is uh, that we're always together whether that's um, eating, napping, watching a movie, sleeping, doing homework in the lobby together Everything we do is together, um, and you don't get that experience at school because uh, you're on campus and you're in different buildings, but when we're traveling and on the road, we're all in the same building, all in the same place, and we choose to all do it together. Why, why do we bond more when we travel? Uh, probably because we get to experience uh, a bunch of different environments that we wouldn't normally experience uh, together. It is a bonding, uh, a bonding scene for us because... We do look out of the usual, and um, at the end of the day, traveling is a bonding experience that I'm going to cherish forever and one of my favorite parts of playing Baylor soccer.